Now, I've just been photographing um, at uh, Aberthaw Power Station, or j just on the outside of it, and um, there was some debris washed up. Um, I've just been waiting for, for about three hours before I actually started walking. I walked about a mile along the, the seashore, and um, there was some debris washed up, and within that debris there was a, an old bicycle, which um, formed quite interesting composition for the, the foreground. So. Um, I used that and photographed the power station in the background. I also um, photographed, there was an outlet from the power station, so I photographed the outlet and, and the bike was, was actually, had been washed up onto this outlet. So uh, I took some pictures there and the sky was pretty interesting, the light was pretty good. And the exposures were, were quite short tonight, 30 seconds, so um, it's, it wasn't too bad, you know, some of the exposures at 10 minutes, 15 minutes even, so um, it, it was good, I've, I've enjoyed taking pictures tonight and uh, sometimes you find these things, you know, like things that have been washed up and uh, the bicycle and so on, which is uh, always a bonus to, to photograph to see if it works or not, but um, there we are, so we'll see how it goes, but um, I think Aberthaw Power Station actually supplies um, quite a lot of South Wales, certainly Cardiff and the surrounding area, the Vale of Glamorgan, to generate power. And um, a lot of their coal is actually brought down from the valleys from the open cast uh, mines, which are in operation these days. Um, so uh, the, you can see the coal tips, and uh, obviously it's very, very much fenced off, and I didn't have permission to go in, but uh, it's quite nice to walk around the outside. You can walk freely around the outside of it. and. Um, you know, you're next to the coast as well, which is uh, quite good. So hopefully you get some good stuff. Right, I'm going to drive home now.